An overnight shooting on the edge of the St. Rock neighborhood left one teenager dead and another hurt. It happened after midnight last night in the 3100 block of Frenchman Street, and that's where Paul Murphy's joining us live tonight from the scene with all the details on what happened, Paul. Katie, we are at Frenchman and Benefit Streets, not far from Elysian Fields. This is where police say the shooting happened early this morning, and neighbors tell us that they are saddened but not surprised by the level of violence involving young teenagers. There is a trail of blood in front of several homes in the 3100 block of Frenchman Street on the edge of the St. Rock neighborhood. New Orleans police say a 15 year old was shot and killed here and a 14 year old was injured during what neighbors described as an exchange of gunfire around 1230 Tuesday morning. I hear the gunfire erupted. Boom, 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 boom. That stopped and shooting started again from a like a smaller caliber pistol. You know, it was like they was returning fire if somebody was shooting at them. One man spent part of the morning cleaning blood off his porch. He said one of the victims knocked on his door seeking help after the shooting. One bullet lodged in a nearby trash can. Neighbors told WWL TV the teenagers may have been burglarizing cars when shots were fired. If it was car burglaries that uh, if that was the reason why these kids got got shot. Um, I'm disappointed as heck to hear that, but I'm not totally surprised because it's been happening so much that people are getting frustrated. Byron Laurent says there have been a lot of recent car burglaries in the area. The NOPD released this video of someone breaking into a vehicle early Monday morning in the 3600 block of Frenchman, just blocks away from the overnight shooting. You hope that it will stop, but you don't want to see these young kids get hurt, get killed. But uh, I'm not totally surprised that something like this happened. Another neighbor who did not want to be identified said teenagers should be home in bed, not on the street at 1230 in the morning. Kids should be inside that time of night. School is the next morning. They should be getting ready to go to school. And police are currently looking for suspects in the shooting right now. They are only described as two unknown men. In St. Rock, Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News.